Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Ness. Today I'm going to share with you guys my top pick from the Uniqlo U just released last Thursday. And as usual, I'm going to share with you guys how I personally like to style these top picks. Let's go. Uniqlo U is one of the sub brand in Uniqlo and one of my favorite sub brand out there in the market. I always looking forward into a Uniqlo U collection release because I really like the fit and also the material that they use on their collections. You don't want to pay too much money on a basic t-shirt or a basic hoodie and they have all the colors that for you to choose from. However, when I try to buy something from their collection, I always try to use the logic over my emotion because some of the items they look good on its own. However, it don't really match up with the stuff that I have in my closet. So some of the item that I got from this pick is actually based on what I have in my collection to go together because I don't want to buy something that it just look good alone by itself, but I don't have any other clothes in my personal classes that I can wear with. So let's go into the first pick that I got from this collection is this t-shirt right here. It's a loose, good cut. The quality is great. The price on this are $40 for this uh, quality of the tee. I think it's worth it in my opinion because I don't have this kind of fit t-shirt. Loose in the sleeve, very comfortable. When you wear this, you can wear them at home or you can wear it outside. And also the key on this t-shirt, what I really love about is it's not that long. The length is pretty good for a short guy like me because I'm only 5'2". It's just above my pocket. Usually when I wear a t-shirt, it's always over, you know, my pocket. The length is that long and the body torso is wide too. So it's very comfortable when you wear this t-shirt and I have a lot of like fitted t-shirt from these collections. I start to spend a lot of money on kind of like loose t-shirt because it's very comfortable. I, this is X small. I got two colors, the off-white color and also I got another color from this collection is um, the mustache color because I don't have the mustache color. I have kind of other pants that go pretty well with this uh, mustache color tee. That's why I bought it. I don't buy the stuff that I cannot really match with the item that I have in my classes. The feel of this t-shirt feel like a knit, very lightweight, very breathable too. I don't know if it's expensive, but 40 bucks for this is pretty good. If you are into the loose kind of fit t-shirt, then this t-shirt is pretty good. So let's go into my second item and also my favorite item from this pick is this bag right here. The drawstring bags, one of my favorite. I was actually browsing on the internet to get a jean bag because my jean bag is kind of broken already. So I need to change a new one. And also I don't want to spend too much money on it. This one was the perfect timing for me because I was looking forward for it. And here we go. It's pretty big, pulled it, secured it, and also very stylish actually. They released three different colors, the black one, mustache, and the green one. Those two colors are pretty nice, so I want to get them. But my classes, majority of my clothes are black, so I have to get the black color to match up with everything I have in my classes. Again, you gotta go back to your classes, what you have, and then you buy based on what you don't have because you're, you're gonna end up spend a lot of money if you based on your happiness when you shop or emotions when you shop it's not gonna be good this is definitely it's my favorite from these collections is uh, this uh, bag right here also in the inside they have the internal uh, pocket as well you can put your phone or put your wallet in there so that's why um, I really like this it's very simple but the style is different you know so let's go into the next item is uh, the denim jacket I don't have this style of the denim jacket and also the color of this denim jacket this denim jacket is the love in the first sight when I saw it on the rack uh, because I feel like this is kind of different what I have in my classes 
but when I'm at home, I try them on. The sleeve is always big, yo. This one, especially, very wide, have roomy in my cup. So, so I'm kind of in between returning it or keeping it. I'm kind of tempting, you know. I don't know the feeling, kind of mixed now. Uh, but I really like the fit on this. The quality on this is not that great. That's a denim kind of raw denim feel. It's not that heavy duty compared to the other denim uh, jacket that I experienced. But the pricing is pretty good. The price on this is 70. Yeah, pretty good pricing on this. And I love the color of this denim jacket. It's definitely give you a different feeling on this denim jacket for sure that what I have in my closet. It's more like traditional choker denim jacket. You can dress up or dress down with this denim jacket as well. They have a lot of cool pocket on this, especially the big two pocket in the side and also the chest pocket. I usually put my phone on this like that. So cool. Or a glasses. I put my sunglasses or glasses on this when I wear them. Kind of have a mixture between that one returning it right now. I don't know. Should I keep it? Leave the comment below in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think. So the next item that I'm going to share with you guys in this video is the cardigan. Man, this is my second favorite item that I got from this Uniqlo U collections. I love the texture of this cardigan. And I love the material that they use on this uh, cardigan. It's kind of a mixture between kimono and the traditional cardigan. I just love the feeling of it. And uh, the fit is kind of 8 out of 10 for me because the length is longer than what I expect. I also have a lot of black clothes that to go well with this cardigan anyway. Um, this cardigan feel like almost like a bomber especially on the sleeve they yeah, almost feel like a bomber jacket but hey this is like have a lot of cool uh, ideas that i'm gonna go with this cardigan for sure this cardigan cost 50 bucks man it's just 10 dollar more expensive compared to the t-shirt that i'm wearing right now um also this cardigan have a internal pocket as well Usually cardigan doesn't have internal pocket, but this one, because the material is thick enough, able to hold the structure, you know, that's why they uh, put the slight extra uh, internal pocket in the left side. And also I don't have the black cardigan, that's why. Um, I just very happy that I got this uh, cardigan. This was the last one. When I went to the store, I was like, yo, this is the last one, X size, X small for this. I got to cover it. And also this cardigan have the second color is the only color. I already have similar style cardigan and the color is very close to what they have in that collection. So that's why I don't want to get it. So let's go into the last item on this list is this blazer. I don't wear blazer, but I'm willing to try out the item that outside of my comfort zone. This blazer is the most expensive on this list because it costs like $90. The fit on this is kind of oversized for me because my body, you know, it's short and tiny. So that's why it's never really fit me good. Unless I really go outside and custom make my blazer, then it's gonna fit me pretty good. I love couple of detail on this blazer. First is the material that I use on this blazer, very lightweight. This sleeve is also long too. However, because of the material used that on this blazer, I able to fold it just like a pair of pants, you know, very comfortable and you feel like not bulky on my cup. Usually when I buy or looking for a blazer that pre make in the store is only big on me no matter what size I got. So there you have it. Those are my top picks that I got from this Uniqlo U. 
collections released this last Thursday and they also released a bomber jacket I already have enough bomber jacket have too much I think I have eight or seven bomber jacket in my closet right now and those color are pretty nice too I'm kind of tempting it always keep in mind that I already have those items in my collection so I don't want to add more there's no point I mean spend too much money that's not good and coat they have four different color coat I'm not really injured. it. I'm a short guy. Those coats are gonna make me look like I'm wearing a blanket. So not really into that. Maybe that will look good on my brother because he's taller. So up next, I'm gonna share with you guys how I like to style these topics.
I hope you enjoyed all those looks I could create go with this pick that I got from Uniqlo U collections. If you like one of the look in this video, give me a thumb up and let me know what you think about the Uniqlo U sub brand in Uniqlo. Comment below in the comment sections. Subscribe to my channel for more video. I have a lot of video coming up every single week and I can't wait to share with you guys. I'm out.